Hey everyone, my name is Matt. Welcome to my backyard. So for the past few months, I've been building this big bandsaw mill here in the backyard. And last night, I finally got the chance to test it out by cutting up this spruce log. Now there's still a lot of work that needs to be done on the mill, but at this point, it's functional. So I did live stream the whole cutting process and happiness event. There'll be a link down in the description to that video if you want to watch the entire thing. This one's going to be a little more consolidated so you can just see the cuts and you don't have to see me laughing and giggling and us uh, messing around the whole time. So let's check it out. I hope this works. Let's go for it, huh? <laughs> go for it. That's ridiculous. Let me just, let's just take a look at this nice piece of uh, spruce we cut here. Oh, wow. Oh, this is amazing. I can't believe it worked. Look, look, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Yep. Alright, so that should cut the one inch thick board minus the curve of the blade. Pretty light. Not bad, huh? Wow, that's just like, I mean, yeah. <laughs> oh, actually, camera better. There we go. So that's what the cut looks like. Pretty decently smooth. Right, here's this one. Board number two. There we go. Pretty sweet. Sick.
Board number two. No, three. 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 Three? Oh, wow. This is a pretty successful first test run thing. We did it. Yeah, let's good. Good job, man. Woo! I was trying to make sure I was gonna hit that clamp. I think I came pretty close. Pretty close, yeah. Let's look. Oh yeah, wow, I had like three quarters of an inch. Yeah, it looked like I was right there. Yeah. <laughs> this ain't too bad, huh? No, looks good. Smooth. We got boards. So there's still a bunch of work that needs to be done to this thing to get it to the point of being like totally functional as a manual mill. And then of course, there'll be all of the automated options and hydraulic options and all that stuff that's coming in the future to make it a fully um, not manual mill. <laughs> so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any of those future videos or any of the actual milling videos that'll be coming in the future. And if it happens to be your first time here, there's a link down in the description to a place that contains all the videos about making this mill and using it as well. So thank you as always for watching. I greatly appreciate it. If you have any questions or comments on the sawmill, anything here in the backyard or back in the shop, please feel free to leave me a comment. As always, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. And until next time, <laughs> happy woodworking.